finally here. Woohoo! Ha! Let's do this! Yeah! Time to take down some iron scum. Yeah. Nice work! Indeed. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's bad. Huh? What's Whoa. that? Whoa. Madripoor, the princess bar. Haven't seen you in a while, Patch. Wasn't sure you'd be back. You ought to know by now. I always come back. Same again. Alright. Oh, bartender. Can I get a fresca, please? Extra rice? No. No? What? No, whatever insane crap you're fixing to drag me into, Spider-Man. I come here to get away from that kind of thing. I'll take a puffish daiquiri. And here is our good dog is here. Or is that reality 6 on the 7? Yeah, I'll have to the count of three to get out before I throw you out. One. Two. No room, Jones? I'll have whatever's strongest. What are you looking at? Short, dark, and hairy. A reason I might actually listen to Spider-Man's pitch. If that's what passes for courtship in your reality. Sure, you're easy on the eyes. But you also make webs nervous. And I enjoy that. Me? Nervous? Ha! Huh. And I say it again. Ha! Huh. It's not like every pretty redhead makes me perspire through my spidey suit. The materials were supposed to prevent sweat stains. I'm the Imagine. This is Agent Jones. We need your help, Wolverine. I thought Spider-Man was the best one to explain things to you, being from your world. I still mostly think so. Bartender, drinks for my... these people. The guy in the webs is paying. Fine. I think one of my credit cards is in the room. Okay, you might have heard about a chunk of Manhattan, including the Daily Bugle, and me, incidentally disappearing. You find yourself in a black costume again? Not this time. We ended up on some Fakata Island. It's in a different universe. The place where every reality came from. The source of that really big bang is a ball of energy called the Zero Plane. For a super long time, the Zero Plane has been controlled by this evil sciencey outfit named the Imagined Order. They do evil sciencey things like snatch people from different realities and make them fight each other. One time they grab some folks from here. Thor, Iron Man, you, Wolverine, from what I hear. I wasn't here to be left out. Maybe a little. Anyway, things are way worse. The Imagine Order decided to pull the plug and start over, wipe out the islands and everyone on it. We're trying to stop them. We have the seven. Except there are only six of them. That's a whole other story. Our redhead here is one of the seven. Hit them with everything you've got. We need to take this outpost at any cost. That's our ticket to the bridge. Their leader's a big armor guy called the Foundation. Imagine if Tony Stark was Nick Fury, but built like the Hulk. Besides Jones, the Seven Army is made up of what we call loopers, and I don't mean golf caddies. They're folks who've been kidnapped from other realities. The Seven are slowly pulling them out of the loop. The never-ending fight I mentioned. We've got this. Even if they seal the door, we can break in. We just have to make sure they don't. Let's cut our losses. Gonna... Copy that. Dr. In the loop, if you get killed, you come right back to light to fight some more. That's never a good sound. Everyone, down! Outside the loop, it's a little more permanent. Fish sticks? Fish sticks? Why? Why you? That's not fish stick. It's a snapshot. 
one of the duplicates of the island makes of people in the loop. Wait, really? Oh, thank the sacred triangle. The real fish stick died a while ago. I'm sorry for your loss, Abel. Hold on. What? Hey, we got them to vote their own outpost and to take out a bunch of their own guards. So, yay? They can replace cars from any of the billion realities. This outpost means nothing. Stalemates are losses for us. We know they are working on the weapon of mass destruction. We need more power on our team. A game changer. I have thought about that. We are listening, visitor. Do you all remember the mecha the Paradigm built? The Paradigm is a missing member of the Seven. Kind of sensitive subject. She did a heel turn, changed sides, and joined up with the Imagined Order. She helped them build a giant robot, Mecha, and that she piloted against a giant monster. Or a kaiju, as the kids say. The Mecha took a beating and lost an arm. At the end of Fortnite Chapter 1, Season 9, the Alana. But won the fight. Afterward, it did a dance. That's kind of a thing here. Lots of dancing. I came up with my own. Wanna see? Okay, sure, maybe later. Anyway, then the mecha blasted off into the sky, never to be seen again. The Seven weren't around for that. They heard about it from Jones, but the Origin is big on research. Interesting. Origin. You traced the mech flight path, right? I did. It crash landed on the moon orbiting the island. Presumably, the Paradigm was seeking other creatures. Considering the icy stretch of land the monster came from was actually a fragment that broke off the moon long ago. That moon is an ice body. Extremely hostile environment. Hurricane force winds. There's been no word from the Paradigm since. If she survived the crash, she would have soon died of exposure. And the Mecha was badly damaged. Presuming we could get there and live, it would take more time than we have to rebuild it. Scientist. Any way to accelerate the process? That mecha would give us a firepower to turn the tide. Well, there are some things I could try. Assuming we could reach the moon and survive there. But there's tremendous risk. The cold could crack even our armor. And any ship we flew there would likely be brought down by weather conditions. Hey, great plan. Loving all the likely to die stuff. But let's put a pin in it for a second. If I can get back to my world, I can recruit a whole army of tough customers. Some of them have been here before, but they were just the tip of the iceberg. We get a whole universe of them, and we love to get all together for cosmic emergencies. We do have one of the imagined Ordress portal devices, but it's only got two charges left. Yes, but each charge could bring the indefinite number of beings back to this island. And from what Jones told us, two of Spider-Man's allies manipulate weather. Yes, Thor and Storm. They totally sign up for this. I hope. If they ease the conditions on the moon, one plan can serve the other. But that only gets Spider-Man back here. To get home, he needs access to the Zero Point itself. At the center of the oldest stronghold. Hey, stuff is my thing. And quips. Stuff quips. And webs. My three things. Plus power and responsibility. Five things. I used to work directly with the zero points. I can guide you to it. I know the path of voice resistance. And adapting to different realities is my thing. Fine, I'll cover your backs. But just to the zero point, I'm needed here. Alright. We'll be back in a flash with the cavalry. Actually, seeing as the gun has two charges, after you send your allies back here, there's something I'd like you to do. What did you have in mind, Origin? My vocation and avocation is the study of various realities. When we briefly seized the Grinch, before the island flipped, I was able to access the Imagined Order's database and learned something interesting. At the end of Fortnite Chapter 2, Alana. Back when Galactus attempted to devour the Zero Point, even though he was driven away, he dislodged a small fragment. As the Devourer was forced back to your reality, that fragment went with him, along with your allies. 
As best as I can determine, the fragment crystallized during its passage and ended up on your Earth. During its battle with the monster, the mecha recharged itself by grasping the zero point. If you can bring back that fragment, it may enable us to power up the mecha in seconds instead of months. Going to miss the big battle again? Huh? Fine. It's kind of my trademark now. I'm on it. My sister is going too. It's not that we don't trust you. It is that we don't trust you. Jones was one of them, and we don't know the skinny guy at all. We just have a personal stake in this. Care to elaborate? No. Fair enough. Also, I prefer wiry. You sure you want to do this alone? They can't spare us both. Order, I'll be back soon. And then we'll get to what we've wanted for so long. Alright, Jones. Any thoughts about the best way in? Oh, do I have thoughts. Prepare to marvel at my genius. See, that's what they don't about toxic waste. Into the ocean? And oh, we're supposed to wade through toxic waste. And not get noticed and murdered in process. The ocean would expel the waste into the void around the island. As for getting in... Press yourselves close to our armor, and the cloaking will cover you too. Body, head, sound, energy will be undetectable. Watch the hands! You're literally encased in armor. Armor that can incinerate you! Engage cloaking, because <gasps> silence from here on out. He's talking to you. Don't know. I'm glad not to have to do this anymore. I swear it's going to give us cancer. We don't know that in Murray, are we? Yeah, but you got those parasites that bury into you. Ah! Why are we cloaked? I like the better cloaked. Uses too much power. I'm jamming any monitoring equipment instead. If anyone comes by and sees us... Too bad for them. So this thing with the doors and the ceiling, that's because the whole island flipped over? Yeah, the imagined daughter seems to have quit this area pretty well. But they've obviously got other priorities besides redecorating. Good, because I thought maybe Mysterio was messing with me again. What's the matter? Have they changed things? Not the way out. Aside from it being flipped. But this new machinery... It's designed to transmit an insane amount of energy. Foundation can wreck it on the way out. Keep moving. Relax, we're doing great. This secret door is our crisis event escapes. It will take us to what used to be... My office. It's exactly as I left it. Except, you know, upside down. Get nostalgic later. The zero point right across the hall, isn't it? Yeah. You guys go ahead. I'll cover our backs. That's the source of everything. The excavation's gone faster than I expected. Wow, that's... I've never seen anything quite like it. And I fought a giant armadillo. Don't touch the zero point until Jones calibrates it. Or what? Or every cell in your body will be ripped from the others and set to different realities. Cool, cool. I'm just gonna stand over here and keep my hands to myself. Hurry up, Jones. We'll watch the door. Gah! One step behind. As usual. Using the secret door to Jones' office was a mistake. I had it alarmed. It didn't take a genius, which I am, to figure out where you were headed. Don't bother running. I diverted troops from the surface. They're on their way. Thoughtful of you to walk straight into a room containing the one thing that can kill you even on impact. Gonna toss him into the zero point. Stick with the plan, I got these two. Jeno, I promised you Jeno, and here he is. That's not Jeno, I knocked this guy out when I saved you from this place. You think Jeno would go down that easily? At the end of Fortnite Chapter 2, Alana. Not Jeno? So, all those times I thought I was missing with the big boss? 
You think Jenna has time to waste a lot on you, Jones? Focus, Jones. We are done. That's what I did. My job for centuries. And the boss didn't even know my name. It's better when they don't. Trust me. Then it's all yelling and screaming and wanting pictures on her desk by noon. Be covered. You. Game one. Worry. And I got it. Just need another minute. You don't have a minute. Go, go, go. I've got to figure out how to make sure they don't follow us. On it. What are you doing? Making sure they can't follow us. Or killing us both. Two can tell these days. No! Damn it! James, you are extra fired! A new foundation are oh, dead! Gunner, on my mark. One, two, now! Knocked him straight out the ceiling. Think he's dead? I thought he was before and been wrong, but it doesn't matter. Our enemies' numbers are reduced. You imagine drones and Spider-Man are gone. Whatever their plan will take time. And they don't realise how little time they have. <laughs>
Your assistance is greatly appreciated. Dr. Von Doom. We admit very, very few to our inner circle. But of all in the Omniverse, you may have been the easiest choice. Welcome. You are already a valued addition to the Imagined Order.